siblings and welcome back to my channel. If you're new, make sure to hit that subscribe button. You're probably wondering why I'm sitting in front of my Christmas tree and that is because I'm going to be doing a video all about spreading Christmas cheer. Christmas is one of my favorite times of the year because everyone's just so happy and positive and loving to each other. It's like strangers talk to each other for once in their lives and it's just a really great time. So in this video, I'm just gonna show you some very easy ways that everyone can do to be able to give back or just spread Christmas cheer and make Christmas a much more exciting time. So if you guys haven't heard of this, my church every year does a campaign called Hashtag Light the World. It's basically a campaign where they just try to get everyone to participate in spreading Christ's love and just Christmas cheer. At the end of the day, it isn't gifts that matters or anything like that. It's about service, spreading love, and celebrating the birth of Christ. If you guys want to learn more about the Light the World campaign, you can click the link in the description or comment down below and I can be commenting back to people on this video. If you want to participate, you can do things, post them on social media with hashtag Light the World, or you can do some of the things that I'm showing you. They make like a little calendar with different ideas of what you can do to light the world. Okay, my intro has gone on long enough, but I'm way excited, so let's go ahead and get started. <laughs> Right now, me and my dad are on our way over to the children's hospital and I have a bunch of stuffed animals and I was like, what a better thing to do than to go take them to the hospital for the kids who may not be getting Christmas gifts or can't go out on Christmas. So we have a bunch of stuffed animals back there and we're taking them to the hospital. We're also gonna stop here at the store and grab a bunch of new toys as well. whoever and then give them to them maybe write a cute little note whatever you feel like doing today i'm going to be making some snickerdoodle cookies which are my favorite so i'm very excited i'm not the best at baking so um we'll see how this goes but it's the thought that counts and i'm not here spreading christmas cheer let's get our recipe pulled up i'm gonna mix together all the dry ingredients so flour cream and tartar baking soda and salt okay i'm just gonna you know what actually hold on especially since i'm wearing all black this is a grand idea. All right, so we mix the dry ingredients together. Now we're going to cream together the sugar and the butter. I don't really know what that means, but I'm gonna try my best. This is very hot, I just got it out of the dishwasher. Oh no. Shoot, I forgot to take it out of the microwave and it's no longer just like softened, it's like melted. This is much butter. Okay, so now we're going to cream this together. You know, I should probably preheat the oven. 350. We're gonna just mix all of these liquidy items together. All right, so now we're gonna add our dry ingredients. Isn't the proper way to do this, you like put a little bit and then you mix it. <laughs> then you put a little bit and then you mix it. I don't know how to go about doing this next step. So I'm supposed to take a cinnamon sugar mix and roll the dough into balls onto it. According to my calculations, I shape the dough into one inch balls and roll them in the mixture. I feel like this isn't right. I kind of want to ask for help. Yeah, one sec. I can have put in here, don't really roll it. I was afraid I was gonna do like too much cinnamon sugar, but no. that's fine. It's great. Okay, it amazing. So good. Thank you so much for the reassurance. I was just telling my parents how this is a life skill. I can cook like all right by baking. Um, this is what happens when I bake. They're like um, a millimeter thick. So we're gonna try to eat one. <laughs> you can see through the cookies. I mean, they're pretty good. They're way good. They're just like thin. <laughs> um, so these are about the same, just wider. So the cookies don't look that great, but they taste amazing. And they're like little squares. So it's just like cookie brittle. And I'm gonna put them in these little Christmas bags and we're gonna call it good. And you know, everyone loves cookies, so they'll appreciate it. 
Even though they're not the best cookies, I still wanted to go spread Christmas cheer. So we're gonna give them to some of our neighbors and hopefully they still enjoy it. I'm also gonna invite them to a church event that we're having a little nativity celebration thing. So let's go. easy just grab your notebook write a letter and actually send it in the mail because we all love getting mail but we like never send mail what a better excuse than Christmas time you know and since Christmas is all about family especially if you don't live with your family this is a great way to keep in touch send a letter to those relatives that don't live near you or even if you live in the same house write a letter and leave it on their bed or something just the thought of someone thinking about you makes you really happy so you should make all your relatives or friends really happy and send them a letter Thus concludes the end of this video. So there are four just super simple, easy examples of what you can do to hashtag light the world. So I would encourage all of you to click the link in the description, figure out more about this campaign that I'm talking about, and participate because the whole thing is just like spreading Christmas cheer and Christ's love. And there's no reason why you can't participate. It's such an awesome thing that my church does and I'm really thankful that I can be a part of it and that all of you can also be a part of it. Join me and let's make this Christmas the best Christmas we've had yet. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and got some inspiration. Make sure to subscribe if you're new. All my social media as well as the link is in the description down below and I'll see you in the next one. Peace and Merry Christmas. Hey.